A devastating fire in Holliston. A woman lost her life trying to save the animals she loved. Both she and her husband had escaped the fire, but then the woman ran back into the home. Neighbors tell us that she was dedicated to those dogs. As WBZ's Paul Burton shows us, they're not surprised that she did everything she could to try to save them. She's always taking the dogs, and you know they didn't have a place to go, place to stay, or whatever. So she, that's, that was her life. You know, take care of them like morning, noon, and night. Kevin Swanekamp is heartbroken over the loss of his neighbor, who lost her life running into her burning home to save the dogs she loved. Horrible, horrible. Holliston fire officials say late Monday night, fire broke out of this Winter Street home inside a husband and wife and nearly two dozen rescue dogs and pets they were caring for together. Initially, the couple escaped safely. Fire in the living room and in the backyard. So upon arrival, we could tell there was fire through the roof and there was an entrapment on the second floor. Um, one of the occupants went back in to get dogs, is what we understand, or some animals, uh, and try to save them. Before fire crews arrived, Swanacamp said he also tried to help. We knocked the fence down when they came out of the house, and then she went back in. So, you know, they, she didn't know what was going on with the smoke and everything else. It took them a while to find her, and they, they gave their best effort. Firefighters took both people to the hospital, but the woman did not survive. Neighbors say she was extremely attached to her dogs. But she, I know she seemed to really love her pets. You know, she took good care of them. Firefighters also tried to rescue the pets, but it was too late. There were quite a few animals that were lost. Uh, they were caged, and and uh, as we pulled them out, we tried to resuscitate. Between the heat and whatever, they you know they lost them all. You know what I mean? It's horrible. I would have done the same thing. You know, but. I feel for her. I feel for her husband. The fire remains under investigation at this time. So far, no word yet on a cause. In Holliston, I'm Paul Burton, WBZ News.